If you are a researcher working in the area of molecular biology, you must have heard about term PCR. And most researchers use term PCR and thermocycler interchangeably, which is not correct. Hello and welcome back to Explore Bio. I am Dr. Abhishek and today you will learn about the major difference between a PCR and a thermocycler. PCR stands for polymerase chain reaction. It utilizes a pair of primers to amplify a DNA or gene fragment with the help of a thermostable DNA polymerase and DNTP mix. The PCR reaction is termed as chain reaction because the number of products amplified doubles after each cycle, just like a nuclear reaction, at least theoretically. PCR involves three basic steps. Denaturation of template DNA followed by annealing of primers followed by primer extension to form a copy of that genomic region or fragment. The three steps are performed at different temperatures which is programmed in an instrument called as thermocycler. This is repeated for about 20 to 30 cycles till sufficient copies of amplified products get accumulated. There is another variant of thermocycler in which amplified product can be visualized in real time due to the use of fluorescent probes or dyes. This is used for carrying out qPCR or real-time PCR. To learn more about real-time PCR or qPCR, do check out my detailed video on it. If you like the video, do share it with others. Subscribe to my channel to learn about other techniques, genomics, markers, plant tissue culture, research and publishing and many more. Comment if you have any queries or requests. I usually respond to them. Thanks and see you in my another video.